What's that? Was that your head? No, that was that. Axe handles. Oh, axe handles. So I this... smoked my head in the drum room so hard the other day oh. on the top. What's... Now, is that... Oh, that's your Mac Jack. Yours is hanging up. So look at this, friends. I mean, look at... Oh, you got the freaking arm pocket. So do you. I'm pretty sure you do. Nope. They're, the they're the same coat. Nope. They're different. I got a pocket on the... You got the arm pocket. <gasps> You're thinking of the partner jacket. Yeah. Damn, that's a cool jacket. No way. The pool and the Dolmar. I, I kind of like that logo better, but that's a bigger jacket. This is a medium. Yeah. These jackets are very cool. Uh, what is this? You know what Ooh. that is? That is an absolute. That's a nice one. It's a beast of a splitting, but look what yeah. somebody was doing. They were cutting cable with it. See it? <laughs> yeah. Both sides are the same. Yeah. Most you ever see that, old. friends? See? Both sides, people were cutting cable. Old that's what that is. yeah the guys will that's what they'll do yeah, yeah. Okay. what do we got here whiskey river whiskey river whiskey river mama what is that okay here's the deal friends okay now we have a good man on this channel a dang fine man a dang a heck of a guy a darn good fella a son of a gun a shenanigan. And he said to me, Buck and Billy Ray, I've been watching you on the YouTube and I've been watching you make those axes and I've been watching your technique and watching your passion and excitement and absolutely heart-filled enjoyment of making axes. And he said, I saw your adder on that handle with the, with the laser beam axe head on it. And I said to myself, John, you got to call that Billy Ray. You got to call him and you got to ask that man if he would make you an axe. And I did call him. Hi, folks, I'm John. <laughs> oh, friends. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what's the matter with me. I don't, but I like it. Johnny, listen, you people that have been hanging around here, you good-hearted folks, you lovely subscribers, you, you bucking army, you've been here a long time. Those of you who have been here, the True Blues, you've been here for five years now. You know that I'm cuckoo, right? Yeah, you do. Um... You've heard me beak off about axes and, 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 and go, oh, deadly and wow, and because I'm excited about axes, right? Well, there's no difference here. There's no difference whatsoever here, none. There's actually a little more excitement. The Adirondack laser beam. I will get mine. Mine is here, hiding in the back 40 here. Where are you, Mr. Laser Beam? Adirondack. I know you're hiding here somewhere, uh, Mr. Oh, wait a minute. Where's the double bit? Oh, oh, I see something, friends. I see something hiding here. Ah, uh, yes. I will show you, friends. I will show you something. Okay, let me show you. Something. Okay. You can see the profile. See it? Yes. Now, I will show you another thing. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Can you see the difference? Or can you see the similarity? I sure can, friends. I sure, sure can. Billy Ray's is on the right. Johnny's is on the left. I'm going to show you something. Johnny. Johnny, 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 Johnny Bobani. Let us live in the traditions of 
the bunker. Billy Ray cannot make an axe. <laughs> and not throw it into the target. I am afraid right now because I get nervous. This is the part where I wonder, oh, there's an axe in there now. Maybe we can hit this axe. I am always afraid at this time, friends, because this axe is brand new. And look at it, it is a mohawk. I'm not sure this will stay. I was playing around having some fun and I will leave it for now. But this is the part that scares me. <clears throat> scares me very much. Bullseye! Wendy, say hi. Hi. Johnny, that was your first throw. Okay, that was your first throw. And it scared me. I'll be honest, it scared me. It's because it's a split and pro flop, John. That's why. This thing's sharp. I'm just telling you, it's sharp. Wow. See that, that, this, this thing's. I wanna show you guys something. I want to show you. Actually, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. Hang tough. Now, there was a, a fella who, let's put it this way. HB and that bushcraft guy. I always forget his name. What's his name? The bushcraft guy. The YouTube bushcraft guy. He did an axe. He did an American fo uh, falling axe with HB. What's his name? Freaking Killinger knows him. He's good buddies with him. I, I, this always happens to me. I, I forget. I'm not even going to try. It'll come to me. It, it will come to me. Um, anyways, you guys know who I'm talking about. They did a thing with HB. He did. Okay. Um, I want to show you guys something. Okay. About profile. I'm going to bring you in. I just got home from working. Me and the boy. Now, so there's a knot. See the knot on the left, right? There. Okay, that's a knot. So in order not to split, get that? In order not to split the wood, I'm gonna go across and that's how I'm showing the profiles, okay? And I'll go behind, like I'll, I'll go, well, no, I won't. I'll just leave it like this. You don't need to see me. Now, let's look at some. These freaking Adirondack axes, friends, they are no joke. They're straight up laser beam show. Okay, now, look at, I wanna show you something. This is very important to look at, okay? Uh, I just got an email from a fella. He, I think he bought one of these axes from HB, the felling axe. What is that guy's name? Ah, it'll come to me. Look at. Okay. See the difference? You see, you see the size of the cheeks? The single bit here. Let's do this. This will be easier. Okay, so you see it, right, friends? Look at the double bit. That's the laser beam on top. See the cheeks? It's fat. Now see the, 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 the one below? That's the HB. It's just a Montreal pattern. It, this is a beautiful axe, friends, by the way. Literally, it's a, re it's a, it's a reissue handle. Like, it, this is a nice freaking axe, friends. I haven't sold it yet. I don't know why I'm holding on to it. I want to show you something. Watch. See if you guys are focused in on this. Um... Yeah, you are. Check it out. Here, 
instantly, right away. Look it. Let's do it again. Okay, so there, right? So I, I can guarantee you right now that that is gonna be a bugger to get out because of the profile, okay? It, it just is, friends. It's not terrible, but it it's... See? Like, it... It's not horrible. There is worse. Watch this. Do you see what I'm saying, friends? Okay, so... Look at... So, profile is everything. It's one thing to split wood and, and have, a, have a great splitter, right? It's one thing. But to waste energy pulling an ax out of the, out of the, uh, the piece of wood is no fun. Let's be honest, it is no fun. This thing's gorgeous. I like that. <laughs> I don't know why I like it. <laughs> I don't know why. Huh. Interesting. Mr. Johnny Old Boy, I'm telling you, partner, this these things feel in freaking credible. There's a dry crack in this one, John, right there. See it? Right there. It's just from from it was dry as it was, and when you heat them, when you burn them, you have to, you know, expect a little dry crack now and again. Don't bother me. And it shouldn't bother you either, John. It won't be a problem. It just won't. I'll soak it full of vodka. Like a cherry pie. Cherry pie. Strawberry wine. Okay, now. I think it's time. I think it's time uh, to show the logger on the drum set. He has not been on the drum set for a little while, friends. It's time. To have a little skiddly dally dum dum dally.
That thing beside the Merc looks like its little nephew or something. <laughs>